I'm Julia Zabo, also known as Pet Reporter, and I am the Living with Dogs columnist for Dogster.com. I've actually written six books, and I'm hard at work on my next one. It will be about dogs. That's as much as I can say right now. <laughs> I love dogs, and I think nobody's life is complete without one. So I'm here to tell you about a variety of different dog breeds that might suit your lifestyle. I hope you'll adopt one soon. The Doberman is a beautiful, beautiful breed of dog. He was actually created by a German tax collector named Carl Friedrich Louis Doberman in Germany in the 19th century. Mr. Doberman wanted a dog who would come with him and be intimidating looking enough that he could go into, you know, among angry people when he was uh, collecting taxes. So, um, of course, the Doberman does have that intimidating look to him but he is a, just a wonderful sweetheart of a dog. A friend of mine is a photographer, her name is Heather Green, and she actually photographs dogs, that's her profession, she does beautiful portraits. And one of her own three dogs is a Doberman named Jaden. And Jaden is really just, she knows how beautiful she is, and she vogues, and she poses, and she comes and cuddles right on your lap. And she literally, like, she comes and sits on my chest when I go visit. So it's properly cared for and properly trained, just like any dog, a Doberman makes a wonderful wonderful, wonderful companion. They have a, a, little, a little aspect of the Greyhound, a little aspect of the Rottweiler. They're just, just beautiful. With a Doberman, you really want to be engaged with this dog. You want to train him or her. You want to do stuff with the dog. You, want to, you don't want to leave her alone, you know, because she's really into you and she's so intelligent and such an athlete. So ideally, you're a person who really loves hanging out with your dog, is active, at the very least you like to walk three or four times a day. It's a mental athlete and a physical athlete, so that's a lot of dog. And But you know what, there are a lot of people who are up to the challenge. It's just a beautiful breed and definitely one of the breeds that, you know, if I live long enough, I hope I get to have.